Hey Sagittarius, welcome back to my channel. I'm here to do your September weekly message. This is going to be for the 23rd through the 29th. Okay, so let's get started. What message does Spirit have for the upcoming week for my Saggies? Uh oh. Ten of Swords. Did someone hit rock bottom? The Knave of Swords reversed. Maybe there's something going on with you where you are not doing so well and you don't want to speak about it. You don't want to tell anybody what's going on. Maybe you have been, em uh, not emo, maybe, maybe emo. Maybe you have been quiet, you know, people are trying to contact you and you just cut communication. You want no one to know what's going on with you. Two of Pentacles reversed. Maybe somebody dumped you or you got dropped from something, or you just let go of whatever it is that you were juggling because it was too stressful and too much for you. Knight of Swords. Someone feels the need to come in, rush in, and rescue you. Maybe they need to come in and say something to you to get you out of that mode of, you know, feeling like you hit rock bottom. Maybe you're a little depressed. Feeling left out in the cold with the Five of Pentacles. I feel like maybe if you were in a third party, someone was let go of and maybe that was you. And you are in disbelief and now they're like coming back rushing and saying it's not what you've seen or blah blah blah. Maybe they are coming back with an apology because they feel bad for leaving you left out in the cold. Maybe they betrayed you or they had to pretend they did for some reason and they've been trying to contact you and you've been like cutting them out or this can go vice versa three of cups reversed this is you uh postponing get togethers celebrations maybe you had to Maybe you had to like stop. Someone maybe put a stop to an engagement or whatever it was. And someone's coming in with an apology. They're, they're, they can't believe they did that. Something happened with their eyes open and your eyes open. And they're like, fuck, I shouldn't have done that. I did that to the wrong person. And I feel like this upcoming week for you, there will be an apology. And them constantly trying to get you to, you know, them to convince you that they're very very sorry and you're just not having it see you don't want to communicate ace of swords reversed you don't want to communicate you're blocking them out phone calls up the ass text messages every form that they can contact you has already been done or will be done and you're just like no king of pentacles it could be someone you work with it could be a lover it could be your husband your wife Someone who possibly was a breadwinner, maybe there was a cheater, and you are in disbelief that it happened. The lovers reverse. This could mean that you are not willing to make a decision or a choice, or this could also signify an Aquarius Libra Gemini or a lover who has who's you're not doing very well with. The Empress reversed. This is you, Saji. I feel Empress reversed with the devil. You are not doing so well. Some of you could be turning to alcohol and drugs to numb the pain because you cannot believe what's going on with your life right now. I feel like it's only temporary. You feel like your whole home or whatever that you worked hard for, your marriage or your work, whatever, is turned upside down with the Four of Wands reversed. You thought we were so happy, everything was going great. What happened? Something took a, a turn. I feel like you are being tested, Sagis. Tempered to reverse. Somebody needs healing. You need healing. You need to take care of yourself. You need to get out of that devil energy. 
take care of your body. Heal before you get into anything else anymore. Okay, so this upcoming week, what does Sag you need to do? Eight of Wands reversed. You just need to take it slow and easy, okay? I know that's very hard for a fire sign to do, but you need to take it slow, take it easy. Gather your thoughts, gather your emotions, take care of yourself with temperance reverse. We want this to be in the upright where you're taking care of yourself or you're having healing and all that. But right now we want you to really, really stay away from parties, okay? Stop drinking, smoking, start drinking a lot of water and start taking care of your health. Because if you don't, you are going to get worse and you're going to end up in the hospital. We don't want anybody to end up in the hospital, okay? So let's just, let's not go there. <laughs> All right, um, let's pull a lover's oracle. Sagittarius. We have passion. A magnetic and seductive quality surrounds you at present. Enjoy it. Ooh, maybe somebody new will be sparking your passion. Maybe someone that you share a passionate connection with is doing this to you. In order for you to have this passionate connection, you must find some healing within as well. If you can do anything, what would it be? The answer dwells in your heart, not in your mind. For the heart is a gateway to the soul. Soulmate. Your soulmate is already with you in spirit. Believe this and they will manifest physically. One more for Sagis. Wow. My beloved. Though we may be physically apart, spiritually we are always united. For love transcends space and time. Nothing is missing. You could have a twin flame soulmate who have, you are in separation with, okay? And the only way for you guys to get back to get it together again and flip this four of wands around, the 1111, you must find the, you must find the strength and the stability to slow down, to stop what you're doing, block everything out and everyone out. Find your inner self, your inner strength. Practice self-love. Heal yourself within and out, physical, mental, emotional. Then you'll be able to enjoy your lover. You'll be able to enjoy yourself and life more better. Okay? All right, Sagittarius, this was your weekly message. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in your next video. Bye.